morning, good morning. Welcome to day two of Miser's Dream. Uh, today we're back at location at the Panopticon doing scenes 11 and 12. It's hard to get around, don't uh, This is mm, quite heavy for Avita and not so heavy for me. Scene 11 is when the two of them start to argue just a little bit. And then scene 12 is Avita's song. So I have it a little bit easier. It's the first day that we're doing any, look at that sun, beautiful light. Uh, it's the first day that we're doing any of the musical numbers, because Miser's Dream is an original musical. So it's going to be interesting to see how we uh, deal with the playback uh, and all the complications that come from that. As I say, it's not for me to think about today. It's all for me to, so good luck. Uh, I'll see you at location. Casually on my way to set, I walk past the world's largest and one of the oldest terracotta fountain. Beautiful morning commute. So, uh, makeup done, costume done, uh, just waiting to do the first scene up in the attic. It's really creepy and it's really um, old fashioned and derelict, pretty much just falling apart. There can only be three of us up there at one point, so. But it's stunning, it's absolutely amazing for what we're trying to do. So yeah, it's quite an exciting scene. Just kind of chilling until we get the call to head up. And uh, there's a few extra scenes being added in this evening or this afternoon to just fill out the montage that we, we did yesterday. So yeah, just waiting around to be called and then we'll get started. So we're all just kind of hanging around waiting uh, to go the first scene. Here is a lot of the crew. Have Alice working away on the costume down there. We have Sabina, production assistant. We have Derek, who was photographer yesterday. I think that was Robin who just walked away there because she's <laughs> hiding from the camera. And we have oh, the team. We're all just hanging around, chilling, waiting on the director because the director's taking forever. So unprofessional. And we have Avita getting her makeup done by today's makeup artist, <laughs> who is also our magic consultant. This is Liam. Stephen's just come back from New York on Broadway. He's too good for us. And that's sweet. Now, I was very rude yesterday because <laughs> on the vlog I was like, that was production assistant realizing that I didn't actually say it was Sabina. This is Sabina. <laughs> she is a bundle of energy. She is uh, amazing at the start of the day and then really annoying at the end of the day yes. because she's still full of energy. Yep, that's the one. On set, we're just about to film uh, the attic scene. And then because there's so few people out up here, it's all going to be done with more of that kind of time. So it's going to be really, really interesting and really fascinating. Uh, I can't show you too much. You can see the black is going to be um, quite old. Two more shots with the montage scene, which includes magic. So we'll be using hair, we'll be using handkerchiefs and um, handcuff escape as well, which is quite exciting. And that'll be added to the montage stuff we did yesterday. And that will be all wrapped at the Panopticon in Glasgow. Uh, that is kind of to Edinburgh tomorrow um, to shoot in uh, some of the uh, some of the room, individual room scenes. So we are coming to a close. So my battery kind of died and I didn't get to finish off the vlog on location, however the end of the day went well, we got what we needed done, there was a few, it was quite close, we were getting close to the time, but we got everything we needed done uh, with a few minor changes that are going to happen at different locations which is all very exciting. Uh, our director is uh, brilliant in the fact that she just knows exactly what she wants it to look like and if there's an issue then she can just quickly change it uh, and uh, knows exactly how to make it work which is really exciting. 
So that's it for Glasgow for a couple of days. We are in Edinburgh tomorrow. Um, so that's a nice early start for a few new numbers, a few songs and a few extra scenes. Uh, it's a long day tomorrow, 9 o'clock till 9 o'clock uh, to get everything done, which is going to be brutal. <laughs> so that means the last couple of days have been relatively easy. Uh, however, it's been great, really enjoying it so far. Only into day two, seem to have got loads done. Uh, and bring it on tomorrow. I shall see you guys then. Good night.